So one of the studies was a Sydney Heart study in which they took men, 1966 to 73, seven years of observation, a group that was said, we're going to give you the healthy oil, the vegetable oil. It doesn't have saturated fat. You're going to live longer. And to another group, you said, go eat the lard and beef tallow. You'll be, we'll see what happens to you. This is what happened. They could not believe the data, so they did not publish it. There was a 62% higher chance of dying in the group that consumed vegetable oil compared to the people who ate traditional oils. There was another study that was not published. This is called the Minnesota Coronary Experiment. So what happened in this trial? They had over 9,400 men and women from ages 20 to 70. The intervention group was said, hey, we're going to give you the healthy vegetable oils. We're going to cut down your saturated fat. To the control group, they said, go ahead and eat what you want. And they said, when you do that, your cholesterol level is going to go down and low cholesterol is good for you. And in fact, the cholesterol level did go down by 13.8% by consuming vegetable oils. If you want to reduce your cholesterol levels, one of the best ways to do it is to eat vegetable oils. So this was their hypothesis. Replace saturated fat with vegetable oils, you'll decrease your cholesterol levels, you'll decrease heart attacks. What do you think happened? There was an 86% increase in heart attack in people who consumed vegetable oils compared to people who have said, eat saturated fat, you're going to die. There's another study called the Rose Corn Oil Study, smaller experiment, 52 people, two-year trial, the replacement of saturated fat with corn oil was done. There was a 92% increase in cardiac events and a 64% increase in cardiac death. Smaller study, take it with a grain of salt. So this is the Los Angeles veteran study. And in this study, uh, roughly 850 men were taken and they were given two options. Take vegetable oil and when you take vegetable oil, it'll be low in cholesterol. So even though there is no cholesterol in vegetable oils, the vegetable oils have something called phytosterol, which is plant cholesterol. And when we eat a lot of plant oils, the amount of phytosterol, which is not good for us in our body, goes up. So in this study, the comparison was between two groups, a group consuming vegetable oils and a group consuming animal fat. The amount of polyunsaturated fatty acids, which is marker of vegetable oil, was nearly 40% compared to 10%. Cholesterol was roughly half of what the saturated fat people used. There was an 82% increase in the risk of cancer by consuming vegetable oils in this group. DoctorsToTrust.com. Please share this video with loved ones.